Hello and welcome back to Artful. Today we're looking at monoprinting. To start off with we're using one of our larger vinyl stickers to create a frame for our printing area. Now applying the sticker can be a bit fiddly and a bit tricky but what you're aiming for is the sticker to be as flat as possible to your screen. When you are monoprinting you are painting directly onto the screen so you do not want the mesh of the screen to be touching the table or any paper otherwise that paint is going to transfer to whatever's beneath it. So what we've done is raise one edge of the screen with a bit of tape, just none of that paint transfers onto anything until we're ready to print. You're going to need to apply a very liberal amount of paint because that paint will start to dry immediately. Most of the colours we're using are from the Artful Screen Printing Starter Box, but the darker blue is from the Upgrade Box, a link for which will be in the description. He's using a white and a red for the petals of the plant so they'll pop a bit more in our composition. And just for a bit of emphasis, we're using the yellow as the pollen for our flowers. And using the blue and the dark blue for the background. You're not going to want to leave too many gaps in your design because when this design is finished and you can pull the paint down with your squeegee, those colours will start to blend together. Once you're happy with your final design, you can register your screen to the paper. Holding your squeegee at a 45 degree angle and making sure the rubber of the blade flexes towards you, pull the squeegee towards yourself in one smooth motion. Now remember, unlike when you have a stencil and you can just keep making prints, with monoprinting you only get one shot of this design. So make sure you're happy with your final design before you pull your squeegee towards yourself because it's a one and done. And if you want to make another version of this print, you're going to have to paint it all over again. As ever, once you finish your monoprint, it is important that you wash your screen immediately. Otherwise, that paint will very quickly dry into the mesh of the screen. Just a couple of minutes under hot running water with a bit of washing up liquid should do the trick. And whilst you wait for our next screen printing top tips, why not watch some of our other tutorials on YouTube or on artful.co.uk. Thank you very much again for watching, and I'll see you again soon with a new video.